Sleeves here with your Senior Pickleball Report, brought to you by TNC Network. Let's get it going. If you like this content, please consider subscribing, sharing, commenting, and check out our socials, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Instagram. Today, I want to talk about fast hands in pickleball. A few weeks back, I put a video in by Cliff Pickleball where Rich Lively talks about the importance of kind of keeping your hands out in front of you and not letting that ball into you or not turning to hit that ball because it wastes time. There's another video I've posted that I thought has got some interesting technique philosophies and that's by um, Pickleball Pirates where Joey talks about the idea of not always having to go back to the ready position. Um, it's just another wasted move, so to speak. So check out those two links. I also did a YouTube search for fast hands and pickleball. So there's plenty of videos to choose from, plenty of ideas to consider. And remember that certain things may work better for you than they may work for um, other people. So there's not a one-all fix-it or um, best way to do this. For me, I was playing last week in a gymnasium with a reflective floor and the ceiling was kind of similar to the ball color and I was having trouble picking up the ball and I was really getting eaten alive at the net. So what I did was I took my you know standard grip and I've seen people do this where they kind of put two fingers on the paddle. Well, I even moved it up more and kind of made it more like uh, table tennis and I put my thumb on the paddle as well. Now I've given up a little bit of length but this is an elongated paddle, so it kind of helps me out on this end if I give it up down here, so to speak. And it's a thin paddle, and it's easy to move through the air. But it really becomes easier when I kind of hold the whole paddle with three, um, you know, three fingers. It allows me to not only get around on it faster, but I can get my forehand around really quick as well. So that's something you can check out. Um, Rich Lively um, has got really fast hands, and if you look at his video, you can see why. Rick Witzkin this weekend in Mesa um, went for the Triple Crown. You know, Rick's known for his really fast hands, and he won the men's doubles 50-plus. He won mixed doubles 50-plus, and he took fourth place in singles. And mainly due to his hands, he's incredibly fast. So these are people you can watch. You can watch Dylan Frazier, who's a pro. J.W. Johnson, um, Anna Lee Waters and her mother Lee Waters, um, the Johns brothers, all these folks have really fast hands. So see what they do and you can sort of imitate and mimic some of that. But what's worked for me is really kind of choking up when I'm at the, you know, the net and getting that paddle around quickly. Well, that's it for this week. And hey, it's a beautiful day, at least where I am. So let's pickle.